Nate, what are you doing? You shouldn't be here. You never finished talking about what happened. Yes, because your girlfriend turned up. It has to stop. I don't want it to. Okay, what's happened? So now you've sent him home, then you know that if you'd answer your phone. I knew he wasn't right this morning. Yeah, well, then you should have thought about that then, shouldn't you? Why? Am I supposed to just drop everything when you call? I suppose your job's more important than mine. I didn't say that. No, you didn't have to. I've got the farm to run, I've got this place to keep tidy, and how dare you lay this on me? OK, look, serious. Maybe I should stick around. This is my family. It's got nothing to do with you now or ever. Is that clear? OK. If anything, you're making things worse. So please, Nate, just... just go away. I really don't have time for this. Kane had no right blaming you like that. What? And you think I need you to tell me that? No, that's not what I'm saying. You don't have any right to have an opinion on my life. I never said I had. You were angry. Get it. <sighs> but you know where I am. I hope Isaac's OK. Have you got time for a brew? Give me a chance to say sorry for snapping before. I'm sorry I didn't answer the phone earlier. I should have been there for Isaac. Well, at least we agree on something. Oh, wasn't expecting you back so soon. I thought you'd be avoiding me. Hmm. Not sure any of us are in the mood for games. Probably best to have everything out in the open. What is it, Cain? I've been, um, talking to Chas and Debbie. And they're going to need my help up in Scotland. Things haven't been exactly great here, have they? Hey, you don't have to try and justify going to me. If Debbie's asked for your help, it must be important. No. It, it's going to be for a week, uh, two at the most. But if you don't want me to go. If Debbie needs you, then you should go. I mean, I'll miss you, of course, but... I'll just have to make the most of you until then, won't I? Mm. He's going to visit Debbie in Scotland in a couple of days. I see. Don't get ahead of yourself. It just means it's going to be hard seeing her now when he's not around. But Paddy, Beer. We could always find ways around that, couldn't we? If we did, then we would need to agree on a few things first. No feelings for a start. Which means we need to be careful. Only meet when it's safe. No risks. Agreed. Hey. Only when it's safe. Do you want me to do some washing before you leave? No. Nah. Are you sure? You've got no clean shirts. We won't need any. We're only visiting our Debbie. We'll be back in a minute. What, where are you going now? Car bulb is changing. Unless, uh, unless you fancy some quality adult time. All right, and leave Kyle on his own. Any chance of a sandwich? Uh, yeah. Already done. You read my mind. What's happened? What have you said? Nothing. Come on. I'm taking you up. Oh. I've just walked back from the village. Walked. Oh. What have you stood in? Well, whatever's in the yard. I mean, there's cows everywhere. You should so have it... left your boots outside. Oh, I'm sick and tired of cleaning up after everyone. All right, love, what's got your dander up? The... Your mummy's not in the best of moods, is she? No, I wasn't until I saw you. I could take offence at that. Well, I hope you can put a smile on her face. I'll try my best. I am having you all to myself. Oh, what about him? Ah. I'll drop me off when I drop him at my dad's. You've thought of everything. So get his gear. He's getting off for Scotland, yeah? No. Nope. He's at the garage. Maybe we could, you know. You're going to tell me why Amy was upset first? All good now. <laughs> and you really expect me to believe that? <sighs> Please tell me you didn't tell her about us. Oh, God, no. I'd never do that. Then what was it, then? It's just... 
Just another fight with a mum. Something or nothing. Sorted now. Forget about it. What were Amy and Kerry fighting about? It doesn't affect you, so just drop it, yeah? Fine. Back to work, then. Everything sorted at the garage? Hmm, for now. I wish you didn't have to go. Well, uh... Could always stay here for a bit. <laughs> Ooh, yeah. Can you really spare the time with your long drive to Scotland? Mm, yeah, yeah, I can spare the time. Shall we? We shall. Thanks for making the time. <laughs> what are you looking at me like that for? He's a lucky man. It's what you brought him with me for. I can't answer that. You just love playing games, don't you? We're both in relationships. I'm married. Don't make things difficult. What's happened? You know, sometimes I just don't understand you. I'm done. What? Nate, uh, come on, don't walk away from me. We'll just end it and stay out of each other's way. No hard feelings. Oh. That's where I'm at right now. I want this to carry on. Help me out here, Nate. What do you want? <laughs> <laughs>